rectangle tool. It is used to add rectangles to our drawings. Click on the starting point and then drag your mouse and release the mouse button at finishing point. We can change the size of this rectangle from here. Here I want 6 inch width and 4 inch height. We can change the outline size from here also. For example, I want to change it to 4 point. We can also change these straight corners to round corners. Select this rectangle by the help of shape tool and now drag your mouse. We can specify properties for these round corners from here also. By default, these will remain locked. And when we change the properties of one corner, the properties of other three corners will also change automatically. For example, I want to change it to 0 0.6 point, 0.6. So you can see that the properties of all these four corners has been changed to 0.6. Here are also three styles for these corners. We can select any one. Now if you want to change these properties separately we can do it. Here is another rectangle. Just unlock these properties. Change it change separately the properties of these corners here on the I change the properties of this corner and I want to change the properties of this corner also so I can do it from here you can see that we have added multiple multiple corner rectangle here if you want to add a square then hold down Control key and drag your mouse. So by this way we can add rectangles to our drawing. Three point rectangle. To define the baseline for that type of rectangle, click on the starting point and drag your mouse. Now release the mouse button. After after that, move your mouse and you can define any type of rectangle where you want for example you want a rectangle here so i will click here click on starting point and drag your mouse to define the baseline and now move your mouse to the point where you want to finish it So these are the function of rectangle tools.